Let's get into some things. Let's get into some things. Hi guys, it's Kamar. Welcome back to my channel. I just finished 30 days. In 30 days, I lost 30 pounds. I, you know I don't like to waste time. This time around, I filmed it for you guys. I've seen my first video when I did it. There was a lot of questions, comments. People were kind of confused. They wanted to see a visual. So this time, I, I documented everything. So I vlogged it completely. I showed you guys what I ate. I showed you guys the grocery stores I went into, what to pick up. I showed you guys everything. Hopefully this answers your question. I'm going to let you guys watch the vlog first, and then we're gonna come back here and try to wrap it up and conclude this everything. Is the eats. All right, guys. Today is Wednesday, January 4th, day two of our 30 days. Here is dinner. I didn't do any lunch or anything, so this is all I'm having. This is what I'm having: some fruits and some water. No tea, no juice, no seltzer water during this. Strictly water. So, um, that's what I'm doing. So yes, I told you guys I'm gonna do 30 days. So fruits for 30 days. Oh, I can weigh myself right now, actually. I just do it a few times just to make sure it's correct. I am currently, as of today, 216, 216 pounds. Okay? All right, you guys are here. We're doing 30 days. This is day two. So I'm gonna bring you guys. I'm gonna bring you guys along the 30 days um, and show you guys the weight loss. And see where it breaks me. After um, my 90 days, I ate fish. I, had, I tried meat. I tried out different things. But now that I know what type of habit eating habits I want to create, I just want to reset myself again and then just go strictly plant based, which I finally realize the difference between vegan and plant-based the difference between a plant-based diet and a vegan diet is plant-based just has to do with the diet whereas veganism is an entire lifestyle based on ethics and the ethics of not exploiting animals at all for any reason I'm gonna go plant-based not vegan but plant-based <laughs> all right guys so I didn't get to vlog today about what I ate but I had one tangerine today um, that's all I ate today uh, I ate that around Mm, was it two around two ish at work? I'm feeling a little hunger. I'm feeling some hunger pains. I'm feeling some hunger pains. I will not lie to you. I'm feeling some hunger pains. I'm currently feeling for kava or chipotle. Like, I, I, I'm feeling for something really good. I'm feeling for some guacamole. Like, I'm feeling for a meal. I'm feeling for a, a hearty meal. Hope you guys are enjoying, like, seeing the the visual aspect of going on this type of diet back to like where you get your protein from i don't know my love i don't know all i'm eating is fruits and water and drinking water that's it no, no pills <clears throat> no supplements no um I don't know. I was getting a lot of different questions like my cal calorie deficit. I don't know the, the answer to that. I mean, like protein, where am I getting it from? Not getting it from anything, obviously. Um, why I'm doing it just fruits this time is because a lot of people were saying that like most of the vegetables that I named were fruits. So I'm just going to do all fruits this time. So what, what do you guys have to say about that? I'm going to do all fruits this time and we're going to get the same results. I already see it in my face like I, like I look a little slimmer. So, I might told you we just showed you guys a video. I'm putting in fruits. I added some grapes there. They're not frozen, but I just added some gra grapes. Like I said, I usually put it in the freezer. I don't want a different vibe. All right, guys, I'm at work. I just went to the grocery store to go pick up. Um, some of these i'm not gonna eat all of it i just took out some pineapples and some of these mixed fruits here um, i just took out some of those um yeah so that's what i'm gonna do right now okay guys i'm having some frozen fruits i didn't really eat all day today so this is kind of a little late dinner super late dinner <laughs> so um yeah like i said we don't restrict ourselves or i don't restrict myself during um 
when I, did, when I did the last time, I didn't restrict myself, so I'm not restricting myself now. I'm eating as much as I please. I am going to um, my local grocery store, ShopRite, so you guys can see um, the prices and how they vary from Whole Foods. So this is a more cheaper alternative to getting your fruits, so that way you have two different options. You have a more expensive option and you have more a cheaper alternative. So I'm gonna go to your local grocery store and I'm gonna show you guys the fruits that they have at my grocery store. All right, guys. So we spent a whopping eighteen forty-five. Twenty dollars. If you wanted to, oop, focus, focus, focus. So if you wanted to just do your local grocery store, it's even cheaper that way. Okay, guys. So today is I don't know. It's pretty late. I'm supposed to go to bed right now. I'm gonna go to bed, but I just want to show you guys this real quick. Um, so today is day six of our 30 days. And I just want to show you guys, I don't know, I feel lighter. Okay, so it is saying that I am now 208.8. Today is January 9th, about one o'clock. I still haven't eaten yet. I still haven't eaten yet. I'm on my way to work. Uh, I'm gonna bring my, my food with me, my fruits with me so you guys can see. Okay guys, so I just, um, Okay, what we have now. There was more fruits in here, but I started to eat it. It's like uh, nine something right now, so I went to get a banana. All right, so I don't first time I'm in the kitchen with you guys. So, um, my thing's starting to slip off on me, losing little pounds. It's not fitting no more. Uh, what can I say? I'm gonna just make some. I don't have. Any other fruits right now? I'm a little low on fruits, not gonna lie. So, I only have this left pineapples and the bananas. So, I'm gonna to make a little smoothie because I want something heavier. Remember, I told you guys in my last one if I wanted a different vibe of the fruits, I would do frozen fruits, put them in the freezer, have it that way, or make a smoothie. So, right now, I'm feeling very smoothie. I did the frozen fruits for a couple days. Use your bullet. I'm gonna put some of this in here and I just do it with water only. So, let's do that. All right, so we got a light skin smoothie here. <laughs> it, very, it is very much light skin. I'm mad I don't have any fruits, but this is what we got. We're gonna make do with it. And here we go, that's that smoothie. I it's not bad. Mm. 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 Yeah, and then we still got some fruits for tomorrow. So this could be tomorrow's meal. Say hi. Who's your good girl? Who's a good girl? Girl, who's a good sweet girl? Look at her smiling. <laughs> I'm gonna be a little real with you guys. My mom made shrimp and fish the other day. They got sweet potato pie on, on a dining room table. They got croissants, breads. And I'm over here drinking a smoothie. So um, let that sink in. If you wanted to, you could. I could, I could be eating all those stuff right now. I could. So, guys, I am eating a banana. It was like four other pieces, but it was one of the whole banana. But I broke into four other pieces, but I ate them. So I forgot to record, but I got it midway. Okay, guys, I just did. I had a long sleep this one day earlier this morning. I like to put some berries on my apples and put the rest in one container. Okay, guys, 
guys. So I'm just doing some fruits, frozen fruits again. All right, guys, today is January 19th. Uh, it's about 12 30 something. I'm getting up in and I'm kind of late to work right now. So I'm like in traffic right now trying to like get to work so yeah i mean this being real quick for breakfast this is my first time eating all day yesterday i had three tangerines the day before that i had some mixed fruits with two tangerines the day before that i had some pineapple spears so um yeah <laughs> today is day 16 of three days just eating fruits guys i want to show y'all something because i'm crying over here in the club the first time i've hit the ones on the scale in my all my years of living i've never seen a freaking one before my weight, I've never seen a one. I've never seen a one! Now, I always like to say that today, all I had was a banana. All I had was a banana. I showed you guys um, earlier. All I had was a banana. And um, I'm not really feeling too hungry. I'm having a craving, but I'm not feeling hungry where I need to eat. So uh, I'm going to bed. <laughs> I got school and class in the morning, right, so I'll see y'all. It's now 10.50 in the morning. Today is January 20th, I believe. Yeah, January 20th. And I'm about to have a tangerine for breakfast. Today is January 21st, Saturday. That's a Saturday. Um, and I'm just gonna have a banana. It's now 11. It's 21st or the, no, 22nd. January 22nd, um, I just made a banana and tangerine smoothie that's all i had not the best but it'll do i need some substance for today all right so i finally had some time to go to the grocery store at shop my local grocery store and as you can see sometimes they're like a little flavorless so this is the best one i could find i'm just gonna get one today i picked a good one i picked a good one because these pineapples mm, 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 mm. some of you may ask me why i do it frozen this gives it a different texture Make me feel like I'm eating something different. Okay, I had this morning a tangerine, and I just had another tangerine when I came back, and then I just made a smoothie with these. And one tangerine, well, this the tangerine that I had, the second one, is in here as well, so. Okay, guys, so I have a little fruit tip. Sorry, I'm sorry, I have a page now. But, a little fruit left. I didn't eat yesterday, I ate like two of these. Really two of a pineapple, and I yeah. That's all I ate yesterday. Um, I think I didn't eat the rest of this. Yeah, so I'm gonna eat the rest of this. So this is my grandpa today, so I'm gonna eat my bed. Let's see how many days we have left. How many days has it been since January 3rd? It was 25 days ago. Okay, so we have five more days. Ooh, I'm so happy, guys. As soon as January 2nd hits, I think it's January 2nd, no, February 2nd, sorry. Well, as soon as February 2nd comes, I'm coming to Whole Foods to get the guac. That's all I've been craving for, the guac, Whole Foods guac, chef's kiss, some food. I want some food. I want some food, like plant-based food. That's all I've been looking up right now, plant-based food. I'm just like, I'm over the fruits, but I've lost a lot of weight so far. I can't wait to tell you guys the number. Where I spent about 11, Eleven dollars and three cents. I got a big jar of pineapple and um, a blueberry and pineapple mix. Okay, so I'll make some smoothies with this one. Yeah, so this is the first time eating all day. Um, what did I do yesterday? Yesterday I had, yeah, you guys showed you guys yesterday. Yesterday was Friday. They're sweet. Let me this bottle. I'm telling y'all, y'all need to believe me. Look, y'all saw it was full at the top. That's pretty much all I ate. And I'm pretty much good. Like, I'm full. I look a hot mess right now. But, guys, I just wanted to come on here and say that I just created... Ooh, my phone's dying. I just um, created a Instagram page for, like, um, for, like, different foods and stuff. Me and my friends always go out. We always go out. We're always trying out different restaurants. So I was like, okay, why not start to try different plant-based restaurants and show, you know everybody like the different options that's out there vegan wise and plant-based wise um regardless of the restaurant so i made a page for that i'm gonna put it up here somewhere so you guys can see and follow but um i'm just excited to start that new journey because i just know that it's gonna i just know i had the idea a few weeks back and i'm like okay maybe i should maybe i shouldn't and then today i was like you know what let's just let's just make it, it let's is now do it. 25 and january 29th it's pretty late i'm up making a wig um, right now 
new series coming soon. But I just made, um, I got a little hungry. So I did the leftover pineapples that I had, a banana, and a little bit of the blueberries with some water. This is doing it for me. So good. It is January 30th, about 1 something. Sorry, excuse my fan. Uh, it's about 1.30 in the morning. Just came back from dropping my sister off at her campus. Um, I just wanted a little bit of something to eat. So I just got the leftover pineapples and berries that I had left. And I also had some blackberries earlier as well. I'm about to go in the shower, but I wanted to show you guys this, that the last time I did this diet, my, feet, my forehead did the exact same thing broke out I don't know what's the cause of that but it just it break out again I'm gonna put a picture in the last time of how it looked but the exact same thing I just want to show you guys that probably not the cleanest um, quality right now because I'm on my phone today is day 30 of three days I didn't eat today and I didn't eat yesterday I wasn't feeling hungry, like I was feeling kind of nauseous or whatever. Um, and I even brought a banana with me to work today. I didn't eat it. I'm gonna take you guys along the journey of just how I eat afterwards, but I'm definitely ready to start this plant-based journey. Yeah, I just stopped at my friend's house, Sam. She was been raving about this chickpea salad that she's been making. And I'm like, okay, you know what? I can't, she made it before, like, she made the recipe before I, um, I think it was like the week before I went on 30 days. Anyways, I'm like, okay, as soon as the 30 days is done, I'm gonna make sure you hit me up because I love a good chickpea. I love good chickpea. I'm sorry for the quality, guys. The quality is so trash. But she made me, she made me. Oh, when I tell you, I'm gonna tear it up. My God, it's gonna be, it smells good. Okay, yeah, don't mind how I look because my face is breaking out. I just told y'all about that. I need a haircut. I'm getting a haircut tomorrow. More of the story. Today is day 30 of only eating fruits. It's the last weigh-in, um, and then we'll calculate how much we lost over the 30 days. And show you, I, I just wanted to show you how that is, it, it's not hard. <laughs> you are in the way of you. You know, I like to weigh myself a few times. <laughs> Guys, I just reached my goal weight. Guys, if you, hold on. <sighs> no! Nah! 205, that's my lowest I've been. So this is my lowest, the new lowest, new record. Wait, this way, I love the way this way looks on me. I feel, I don't know, I just feel, yeah. I tell you guys that you are in the way of you. If you wanna lose weight this year, you want to be financially stable, you want to just build better habits, you are in the way of you. You are more capable than you think. You have more strength than you believe. Like, take the word can't out of your vocabulary because you can. I believe in you, you got this. Challenge yourself. Even if it start one day at a time. Small steps are better than no steps. I believe in you and you got this. That's all I wanna tell you. That's all. That's the main reason of this video. To prove that you can do it. Because I see a lot of people in my comments, the last video saying, you know, I don't have the discipline like him or I, I, damn, I wish I could. Or, you know, I get if you have different health reasons, but if you, you know you can and you're just being lazy, I'm, I'm side eye, side eye. In whatever area of your life you know you can apply yourself better, apply yourself better. Small steps are better than no steps. Look at the step in front of you instead of the whole staircase. You got this, I believe in you. Your year's going to be great. I keep telling y'all this, 2023 is your year. Just put more belief in yourself, have more faith, and give yourself more credit. Cause you, you got this, you got this. But damn, I just reached my goal weight. Okay. So in this um, time around, I did 30 days. I did 30 days of just eating only fruits. Fruits, guys. So there's no, I only eat fruits and I only drink water. I didn't have no supplements. I wasn't getting protein from anything else. Um, uh, what else do you guys usually ask me? Um, portion size, you guys will see in the video. The last time I did fruits and vegetables, a lot of people were saying that the fruits that are the vegetables that I had were technically fruits. So I said, you know what? We're gonna do it again. We're gonna do strictly fruits. And the results speak for itself, as you guys can see. So I went from 216 to 185 in a matter of 30 days. And 185 was actually my goal weight from the first time I did this. So we're, we're doing great. 
we're doing great and it, it, it feels amazing it feels amazing I look amazing I feel even better than before a lot of things have changed since the last time I did this every time I do this I learn discipline and I learned that whatever I put my mind to I can do and I hope that resonates with you and I hope that is is something that you learned from this video as well. As we're actually, if I have a lot of loose skin, you guys probably can't see in this sweater, but I got some loose skin on my sweater. I still got a little bit of man boob left, but they're not as big as before. And I'm gonna show you guys my stomach as well. My stomach, um, that's the little bit of loose, uh, it's loose skin. As you can see, it's loose skin. So hopefully that helps. So anybody has any questions about that, if you were asking me about my loose skin. So I do have loose skin, um, but I feel like with the gym, that can also be tightened up or with cosmetic surgery. Um, if I wanted to do that, so those are the options that are available to me. So, uh, that's that. I wanted this to be, I wanted to really document it and show you guys this time because I know a lot of people were kind of confused about the portions that I was eating, how I ate them, if I over ate, how, a lot of questions. There's so many questions and I just wanted to make sure I document it for you guys. Thank you guys so much for the, the support. We just hit 11K, I think. 11K. I started... 11k. I, I, I can't. I, I can't wrap my head around it. You guys are amazing. It, it means a lot to me. And I just can't wait to continue to grow with you guys and watch. Watch not only you guys grow, but me grow. Because as I'm growing, I hope that you're growing as well, and that it inspires you to grow and change in whatever ways and the areas in your life that you want to change in.